identify a we have seen it acrosome name the organelle found in large numbers in part c we have seen them you see it is mitochondria then they are saying give the numbers one two three four only on the diagram uh, representing morula what is a morula and what is a blastula or a blastocyte blastocyte or blastocyst the way you pronounce it as long as uh, remember a morula is just a ball of cells a ball of cells this ball of cells has no hole at all so you look for something which is like that and then a blastula is a hollow ball of cells it must have a hole is a hollow ball of cells so you look for something which has the hole so basically morula is gonna be uh number three uh is gonna be number three and then blastula is gonna be number one and then they're saying uh the structure that will implant in the nucleus which structure will implant the moment you form a, a, a blastula is gonna form finger-like projections which you call chorionic villi which are used for implantation so basically it's gonna be number one again yes yeah, so it's gonna be number one give the letter and the name of the part that will enter the ovum during paralyzation this is the second time they're asking the second same question so it is b and it is what is new nucleus uh -huh. then they are saying that name the type of cell division that will occur to produce the structure structure in three so the moment you have a sperm the moment you have uh, a sperm yes and then you have the ovum nucleus nucleus this nucleus comes here and then you have a nucleus of a sperm and the nucleus of the ovum you form a zygote a zygote this zygote will start to undergo mitosis repeatedly to form a ball of cells the ball of cells which we call morula the mor uh, morula will still continue undergoing mitosis and starts to uh, form the hole in the, uh, in the middle or in the center and then forms a hollow ball of cells which we call the blastula the blastula will form the outer layer which we is going to call chorion and the outer layer is going to form finger like projection which you call the chorionic villi for implantation to take place so which process results in the multiplication of these cells the process is called mitosis mitosis so i've explained the development of the zygote until implantation let me repeat uh yes we have seen that uh sperm fuses the ovum to form a ball of, uh, to form a zygote you see these are two nuclei and they form uh, a zygote a zygote you undergo mitosis to form a ball of cells a ball of cells uh will continue this ball of cells we call it uh morula and then this ball of cells will undergo continue undergoing mitosis to form a hollow ball of cells which we call uh bla stula which forms the outer layer we call it chorion and then the chorion forms finger-like projection which we call chorionic villi basically this is one this is two this is three it's one it's two it's three and then it's four then um 